which choice most logically completes the text? A team of biologists led by J. Hoon Jung, Antonio D. Barbosa, and Stephanie Hutton investigated the mechanism that allows Arabidopsis thaliana, thylgress, plants to accelerate flowering at high temperatures. They replaced the protein ELF3 in the plants with a similar protein found in another species, stiff brome, that unlike A. thaliana, displays no acceleration flowering with extreme increased temperature. A comparison of unmodified A. thaliana plants with altered plants showed no difference in flowering at 22 degrees Celsius, but at 27 degrees Celsius, the unmodified plants exhibited accelerated flowering, while the altered ones did not, which suggests that blink. So option A says, temperature-sensitive accelerated, accelerated flowering is unique to A. thaliana. This is incorrect because the text clearly shows that in two, uh, in an experiment, there were two types of flowers. One with an unmodified A. thaliana, which means that it had the protein ELF3, and one that was modified, which had another protein that, un that, was, not, that did not, was not ELF3. So that flower, the A. thaliana, with, which was modified, had a slower, um, well, did not accelerate flowering at higher temperatures. So this accelerated flowering characteristic is not unique to A. thaliana, it's unique to ELF3. So A is incorrect. B. A. thaliana increases ELF3 production as temperatures rise. This is incorrect because the text doesn't discuss the production of ELF3, it discusses the effects of ELF3, and the text doesn't mention that ELF3 production was increased as temperatures rose. So B is incorrect. C. ELF3 enables A. thaliana to respond to increased temperatures. This seems to be correct because the unmodified A. thaliana plant displayed an exhibited, exhibited an accelerated flowering at 27 degrees Celsius, while the altered ones did not, which means that the ELF3 enabled A. thaliana to respond to increased temperatures. So C seems to be the correct answer. D. Temperatures of at least 22 degrees Celsius are required for A. thaliana to flower. This is incorrect because the text doesn't suggest that a uh, temperature of at least 22 degrees Celsius is required for A. thaliana to flower, and it's sort of unrelated to the main point of the text, so D is incorrect, and the correct answer is C.